Four couples, all just recently graduated from college, have been chosen for an all new competition to navigate through the treacherous terrains of Selva Dorado for a chance to win 100,000 simoleons. Audrina and Dion, the newly engaged couple hoping to use the winnings to start their new life together. Jessica and Josh, a new romance and looking to see where things can go and hope to use the winnings for upcoming business ventures. Aspen and Colin, parents to twins who are at a crossroads in the relationship but have a common goal of creating a future for their children. And lastly, Desiree and Zane, the son of a prominent politician and married the daughter of a socialite after having a set of triplets. They're hoping to use the winnings to jumpstart Zane's campaign for city council. Who will win the cash? Who will lose at love? Find out on Surviving Selva Dorado. Hi guys, Samantha here. Welcome back to another episode of Surviving Selva Dorado. I was about to say something totally different. Oh goodness, Jessica is getting sick, but she is in the process of dealing with the last artifact they have. So I'm gonna pause it really quickly. Audrina and Dion are getting ready right now. We're getting a late start, unfortunately, because A, Audrina and Zane stayed up fairly late talking. And I got pictures to prove it. Dion sat and watched them while they talked pretty much the entire time. It was the craziest thing, but he wasn't even involved in the conversation. He was just sitting there, just kind of looking at them, just kind of like watching. So, and I've noticed this in university life. Dion definitely has like an overprotectiveness. I don't know if it's more so like he's not a jealous sim because his trait isn't jealous, but he definitely has something where, let me double check his trait. Yeah, his trait isn't jealous, but maybe he just feels very protective of Audrina. And I'm not saying that's a good thing or a bad thing. It just really caught me off guard that he literally just stood over them and watched them while they sat there and laughed, ha 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 he he. But it was nice to see them kind of interact with each other and kind of like, put things aside. But um, so unfortunately, she ended up sleeping late. And then Jessica had been working on the uh, vases and whatnot. So apparently, I don't know if it's because her skill is high enough. Uh, oh my God, Brody, seriously. I don't know if it's because her skill is high enough or not. Um, but she was actually able to authenticate her vases. I'm not sure why. Let me see what her level is really quickly. And then maybe Oh, she's like at a level four. Maybe that's the reason why. I'm not sure. Because while she was authenticate, while she was working on the vases and the artifacts, she was authenticating them. I was outside looking at Zane and Audrina talk and kind of hang out or whatever. So I didn't even really pay attention until I went to her inventory and I saw she actually authenticated this golden Amiskin vase, which is worth 933. And I want to say, let me see, because he even had something... Um, this one right here that was authenticated and it was an Am Amazonite harvest knife, which was worth 238. So needless to say, they got plenty of artifacts. So let's go through it really quickly. I'm actually going to just keep the video, pa keep them paused so we can um, get it taken care of. But they end up getting an Optanium worth 25, an unauthenticated vase, which is worth 67, which maybe if they authenticate it, they'll get more money. I'm not sure. An Azanald worth 25, two relics worth 143 simoleons, an alien skull worth 250, um, the um, uh, unauthenticated Amiskin skull, which is worth 65, again, is unauthenticated, maybe worth more, I'm not sure. And then they have the harvest knife that's authenticated worth 238, the golden vase that Jessica authenticated, which is 933. And then we have this one here that she's working on, which Hopefully right now it still is worth 67, but she's still in the process of doing it. And she just did it on her own. Like literally after she finished it, she just authenticated it. So we could probably even authenticate this mask. So needless to say, they're at 1,889 simoleons of value, not even including this one, which means that they pretty much knocked Colin and Aspen out of the running. I don't know um, what we should do about that. I don't know if we should just like, Oh, they're in here talking. Y'all talking strategy? Y'all talking strategy? They're in here talking strategy, y'all. They're strategizing it here. We're going to get out here. We're going to go get this stuff. And we're going to do this. And we're going to do that. And, you know, we get back. We're going to move in together with this money. We're going to get a nice house. And she's like, I want a recliner. And he's like, yeah, a recliner sounds like a great idea. Like, I like recliners. They both nod their head. They're, they're agreeing with each other. Yes, this is exactly what we want out of life. Anyway, um... And then something else surprising happened while I was sitting here watching her do all of this, just trying to see when she was going to be done. Miss Desiree walked her little butt around uh, the corner and yep, you guessed it. Miss girl is pregnant. I didn't even know that she got pregnant. Like 
they woohooed in the closet. You guys remember that episode? And I didn't even think to check to see if she was pregnant or not. I haven't checked MC Command Mod to see if how many or if there's multiples or what the situation is, but um, she's in her second trimester. Oh, she'll be in her second trimester in 18 hours. So she conceived a baby during this little vacation getaway thingamajig. So I thought that was interesting because I was just like, uh, girlfriend, like she literally walked around the corner and I was like, what is this? What is this? <laughs> I wasn't very happy about that. But either way, I just find it very odd. Zane spent almost all night and he's right here. Um, which see, look, they their level is a little bit higher now. Um, they spent like almost all night talking and um, he was like excited to talk to her. I mean, like he literally, like when I ended the video, he was standing over here and he was laughing at her little joke. And then he immediately went and sat down and was sitting like either this chair, or this chair, I can't remember. And she was sitting right here and they just talked and talked and talked. And I was like, Audrina, you got to go to bed. And they just kept talking. And I always knew that they were good friends, but it's just crazy to me that he did that. And he was so engaged in speaking to her and his wife literally just found out she was pregnant. But anyway, it looks like they're already like, hey, we're ready to go. They're getting out of here right now. So let's go on and head. We're going to go head to the marketplace. You know the drill. Try to go get some supplies. I went on and sold. She had like a spider repellent in her inventory. I went on and sold it because I felt like it wasn't fair that she had that, um, you know, and nobody else really had the advantage of it. So we're going to go on and grab Dion and they're already dressed in their gear, which I think is so cute. Look at, oh, I got to get a picture of this one. Hold on, hold on. Cause look how he's looking at her though. He's like, babe, we about to go out here and score. We about to go out here and score. Okay. All right. Anyway, let's go ahead and head out. It's so crazy. I'm looking at her pinned woo, uh, whims. She wants to woohoo with Dion and she also wants to get to know Dion. <laughs> Girlfriend, you, there will be no woohooing going on. Okay. You gonna wait till your wedding night. All right. You will not be getting hooked up around here with all these. There's something in the water, girlfriend. And I definitely don't want you catching it. Okay. Anyway, so clearly there's nobody here. So we're just going to go over here and wait for somebody to show up. We are getting such a late start. It is already 1142. I'm hoping that we can get this rounded up around 12, 1230. And we can go on and get out there and have our little 12 hours. So I guess we'll just sit here and just kind of wait for somebody to show up. But yeah, hopefully we'll get a start fairly early. But um, I'm going to have them just kind of sit and talk with each other for a little bit. Maybe they'll strategize get food from inventory what okay I didn't know you could do that um all right so let's kiss her and then let's just kind of like get to know a bit and um whisper some sweet nothing oh good somebody's here okay good all right so good 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 good, good. all right so let's come over here we got we still have our thousand dollars so we got quite a bit we can buy we can come over here and grab a liquid rush <laughs> and a grilled cheese darn it um, I think what I'm gonna have to do, and I should have thought about this before we left. I can't get his inventory because he's not here. Okay, maybe I'll bring him here because I think he has, um, would that be fair? I don't know if that'll be fair or not. I feel like it should be fair, but then I feel like it shouldn't be fair. But I'm gonna bring him here because technically, yeah, I'm just gonna get the, because I think he has a, um, yeah, I'm just gonna get the a miskin machete from him. And uh, then I'm going to send him home. All right. So we'll get the machete from him. Uh, all right. Is, is that fair? I feel like it's not fair. You know what? It's 120 simoleons. I'll take it out of there. I think it's 120. So I'll take it out of their earnings or whatever. They're, they're winning. They're whatever. I'll take it out of it. <laughs> Basically. So let's come over here and grab some grilled cheeses. We're going to both grab uh, two. And then I'm going to have him get a liquid rush too. And then go grab two grilled cheeses. And so let's see how much that's left with there. And yeah, I'm just going to make them pay for that because that's the only thing I could think of. So we're going to do 120 and I think it was 200. So 200 and then plus another 120. So 120 and then plus 200. Oh, they're so sweet. Plus another 160. So they're at 480 right now. Okay. And I don't think anybody else is showing up. Um, so we might have to be done with it. Okay, all right, okay, good, 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 she's here, all right, good. So we already got the machete, I'm not gonna even worry about it, but let's come over here and grab a waterfall in a bottle, 65, uh, 20, and then another 45. So plus 65, 20, 45. So that's at 610. So she could still come grab some stuff too. So have her come grab a waterfall, um, spider repellent, and a plasma bat. And that is, how much is this one? 65, 20, and 45 plus 65 20 and 45 oh my gosh 740 simoleons they spent quite a bit all right real quick let's check their inventory so we got waterfall spider plasma 
two of these and a liquid rush. Awesome. And then let's check his real quick. Um, wait, how did he not? Okay, so liquid rush, two of these. Spy okay, he got everything. All right, cool. So let's go in and head out. I think uh, they actually lucked up pretty well, which is really scary. Um, so let's just go in and head out. We can go to the trailhead and get started. All right, guys, here we are at the trailhead. And I think right now, um, the probably the best, I mean, I'm thinking, I feel so bad because they got like such a good advantage. But I think the best thing to do is just going to get started excavating over here. And I don't think, look like it's going to be the same exact stuff. We just got to hope that we get like a good something. So who has the, um, okay, he has it. Okay, so I'm going to have him go on and travel through. He's going to go on and venture off by himself. And she's going to go on and get started with this. Um, I don't think that there's anything else over here, but we're just going to go on and, and try to see if we see anything. Is there any avocado? Okay, good. So I'm going to have them come harvest these avocados because we never know. We might need them for like food or what have you. Um, then we have this one we could travel through here. Uh, I want to go to one that we haven't uncovered yet. So I could like use the machete because then I feel like it'd be worth us like getting it. But uh, I'll have them go on and travel through here. I don't see anything. Double checking, double checking. I don't see anything right here. But um, there might be something, which I think is okay. It took us. I, say, I think it's about to take us. Okay, because there's something here, so I'm gonna have them excavate that. And then, um, is there a trail here that we might, we might can partake in? Because if not, we got this uh, machete for nothing. But it's cool. Um, you never know what we need when we come back for the second round. If they make it to the second round, you just never know uh i don't see anything i think this is like a dead end anyway this one's already been taken of course we already did that one um okay and she got that one so i'm gonna have him do this one we're gonna go back to her <laughs> who oh my goodness why do they do this i'm like you're wasting so much time girl girl get up not you not you you all right cool and let's have her travel through uh let's see what does she get she got a another vase. Okay, cool. So she got a vase. But again, with the whole authentication thingy, I don't know what to do. You guys chime in in the comment box and let me know what you guys think. Because if I should, if it comes down to it and we need to get things authenticated, either I'm going to have to get uh, Colin and Aspen's um, thing up there. What you call it up? What am I trying to say? I'm going to have to get their, um, their <laughs> what am I trying to say, y'all? I'm going to have to get their, their skill up. Why can't I talk today? I'm gonna have to get their skill up so they can be able to um, be at least on a competitive level because I feel like it's not fair that, um, and it's not no fault of uh, Jessica's, of course, because she just is brilliant. I said that last episode, I was like, they both are like go-getters. So I could totally see them rocking out this contest. But unfortunately, um, this is so cute. Look at my girl. I should be snapping pictures. Yay. <laughs> but um, I totally could see them rocking it out. And I had said that. So I can't even really complain about it because it just is what it is. But, um, oh, goodness. Okay, Dion, get it together. Looking so suave. And he had to come out here looking like a doggone snack and a half. A sn oh, that was another snake. I got to let these snakes leave me alone. These snakes disturb me. They bother me. They really do. All right, so he's going to come. Did you finish it? Okay, he still hasn't done that one. So come over here and do that one soon. She probably should have came over here with him. But they already know what the competition is working with. They saw all the stuff that Jessica came in with. They saw the stuff that Zane, because honestly, technically they're going against Zane. And that's true. They're going against Zane and Desiree, who currently are at 1270. So we definitely need to get some good finds. All right, so he got an ancient, ancient bone dust. Is that worth anything? Okay, he got a relic. And then he got some ancient bone dust. Is the bone dust worth? Oh, really? Wow. Oh. <laughs> but we did get a relic. I didn't even see when he got the relic. And then is she getting anything? So she got the vase and she should be working on um, the other thing. So hopefully soon and very soon they can be uh, on their way. I think this is the way we came through, correct? Yeah, so this pretty much is a dead end over here. I would love to go find another chest like this because I feel like that's where the money is. That's where the good stuff is. So is she finished with this? Okay, she's finished with that. All right, so she got an unauthenticated skull. All righty. So it's going to travel through here. We're going to make our way over here and see what's on the other side. It's going to take her a little bit, but um, look how pretty the waterfalls look. I want to get them to get a picture too because I feel like everybody, oh, he's got spiders. Spiders. Dion, get them. Did you get them? Okay, Dion seems to have some unexpected visitors. There's no better time to pull out Dr. Parker's think thinks. Wait, thinks? 
Wait, pulled out the Dr. Parton thing. Oh, thanks, Dion. Okay. I read that wrong. I like rushed through it. Okay. So do we need to grab these? Yes. Go harvest that because you never know when we'll need those. And then we have a mound over here. Is he done? Is he done? He didn't even finish it. Oh my gosh. Like if I wasn't paying attention, what time did we get here? Like one or two? I can't remember. Did he get it again? He got more. Sp oh, okay. That must be the same. That's the same thing. Okay. That's the same thing. I was about to say, oh my gosh. Yeah. All this back and forth with the camera. <laughs> oh my gosh. They like split up for real. Okay. So she's going to get this one. Uh, can we try? Okay. We could do this one. All right. So I'm going to have to send him over here to come clear that path. We can't do this one. And so we got that one. We also got this one we could go through. And then this one I think is to the, okay, Royal Baths. That's right. Okay. So yeah. All right, cool. So we do have one that he could clear. And then this one I think is what we just came through. All right, cool. So is he done? Or is you done or no? <laughs> all right. And then he could come over here and, oh no, Adrena got spiders. You got him, girl? Okay, she got, she used the spray. Oh my God. We haven't even been out here for a couple minutes and they're already using the spray up, which means we're not going to, we're going to go through our supplies so quickly. Of course she stopped because she can't concentrate. She got Dion on the brain. She got Dion on the brain. I would have loved to see the spider though. I want to see her like, you know, interact or whatever with it. All right. So is he coming through? He's coming through right now. All right, cool. So he should be making his way soon. While our girl is over here. I love seeing her like this because she's my baby. You know, like we've been knowing her since she was a little girl. And um, so, you know, it's just funny seeing her like this because I'm like, I remember when you was a little girl. <laughs> oh, my goodness. Is he going to? You're, you're taking your little precious time, Dion. We are in a competition. We're in a competitive state right now. We're in competitive mode. I'm going to need you to get this together. I mean, I do like the view, though. Don't get it. Don't get it twisted, though. I am enjoying the view, though. Except for that plum bob in the doggone way. I wish that there was a way. I guess you could take headline effects off. But when you take headline effects off, it takes off everything. So then if you hoover over them, you can't see, you know, their name, what's wrong with them, you know, whatever. You can't see any of that stuff. So it's like, I wish they would have just had like a plum bob off cheat. And then, and then, you know, the other stuff off cheat. Oh, my God. Why? Why when he's going up? Y'all, they run, they run so slow when they're going up the hill. It's like you're running, but you're like running in place almost. By the time he gets there, she's going to be done. Is she done yet? Okay. Yep. She's done. Yep. That's how that goes like that there. Um, okay. So this is to the bath. So you know what? I'm gonna let her go through while he is about to go clear this path over here, which if I'm not mistaken, this might actually go to the ruins, which we can't even do that much over here, but at least it'll be clear. We'll do some things, but we won't go through the pyramid because I don't feel like that's fair. I wanted to save that for the last bit for the whoever couple, whatever couple makes it through the last bit. Okay. So she's through here now. Uh, we can't do that one. Is there anything else over here? I am so stopped up, y'all, because allergy season is kicking my butt right now. It is ridiculous. It's just like all of a sudden I'm in the middle of talking and now you, now I sound nasally, right? Right? Don't I? I know I sound nasally. It's horrible. So, yeah, that's what happens. Allergies. The only upside to allergies is that, you know, spring is coming and I'm ready for it to be spring because I'm so tired of it being winter. That's the only positive thing to this whole situation. The only. Uh, all right, cool. I don't see anything else, y'all. Darn it. Okay. So <laughs> I was thinking there might have been some advantages for them going first, for them going last. Okay, so cool. He's over here now. All right, he's already through it. I was thinking that there was some advantages for them going last, but now I'm thinking probably not. All right, Dion forging through some thick vines a little too enthusiastically when the machete. Okay, so we just lost the machete. Whatever. Okay. While blazing a trail in the jungle, Dion comes across a small group of, ooh, capybaras. <laughs> yeah. Hanging out by a watering hole. As he observes them, he notices one of them is approaching a huge swarm of bees. The, they don't seem to notice the impending danger. Um, I think he should scare off the bees. Yeah, he's going to scare off the bees. Okay, Dion wants to save the poor Kappa whatever and the pain of getting stung. So he stays, he starts waving his arms and yelling. The bee swarm immediately turns his direction. Unfortunately, he falls over. Oh no, he got stung, y'all. Wow, he got stung. Well, that sucks. So I'm going to tell him what type of mood he's going to be in when we get on the other side of this, but let's go. Okay, guys, here we are at the um, ruins, I guess you'd call it. Uh, so like I said, I don't want to go too, too far, but I will let them take advantage and kind of um, dig up some artifacts. If there's anything on the outside, like over here, so I'm going to have them excavate that. Uh, I think we can go 
not too far in where did he oh he like disappeared when he went over here that was weird <clears throat> i don't think we can go too far inside let me see though because i don't want to like explore it because i feel like that should be on the last oh see yeah that's that thing right there i think that should be like on the last leg but i want to give them a chance to at least explore as much as possible but i really don't see anything that they could do that she could do rather because he's already doing something what's this okay put in inventory what is it okay we could put that in our inventory i guess let's go grab it we're just gonna put that in our inventory uh she's viewing that okay i don't know what that is but we'll go put it in our inventory see if we could do something with it and then we'll go up a level is there anything up here we could do Y'all, I feel, I feel really bad right now because, okay, there's something here. Okay, so she can go excavate that. All right, so like I said, we won't go in the temple though. We're gonna stay on the outskirts. That is okay with the rules because we're not really going any further um, than just getting the outskirts stuff. So let me get far, oh, here's one over here, good. Whew. I was getting nervous, ah, I was getting so nervous. I was like, wait, my poor babies, they're gonna get eliminated immediately because they don't have anything left for them to get. Um, yeah, I mean, so far, Jessica and Josh are rocking it out. Second level, second, um, I guess, what am I trying to say? The next level up, I guess, for the competition. It's not going to matter what they did this level, but it's just whatever they get can bring. Okay, we can't even go beyond this point. So why even give it to us? Because wouldn't that be so cool if you come beyond this point and there was stuff over here? Um, there's not very much. Quinn Carter, girlfriend, you calling the wrong one. I don't know who you think you is uh excuse you talk about you need to get out of the house don't you have a whole man and a whole baby right yeah that's what i thought she got a whole man and a whole baby like a whole an entire man call him up and tell him you want to go out oh whoa what is this wait did i see what i thought i just saw that was a skeleton what is it doing over here I don't know what it's doing over here, y'all. That just freaked me out. I hadn't seen a skeleton yet. I haven't seen one yet. So that just completely freaked me out. Could we have become friends with him and like take pictures with him and stuff? Are we going to get cursed being here? I don't want none of them to get cursed, y'all. I'm, I'm not about that life, like for real. I'm not. That's one thing I like. I like the Jungle Adventures, but I don't like. What are you doing? What are you doing? Hold on. What are you doing? I can't talk to him. Wait, what's his name? Zygo Hueso. Hueso? Who are you? I'm gonna do a friendly introduction. Oh, he got stung by bees? I didn't even realize that. Okay, can you please not move? I wanna introduce myself to you. What in the world? He's like really pretty though, if this is a dude. I mean, he has like a nice opal, not opal, like an not amethyst. What's the name of that that um, stone that has like a bunch of different colorations and stuff? He has that. I don't know what to call it. Wait, what? Wait, why did she go home? Why did she go home? You you trying to stress me out there, Adrena? Are you trying to stress me out? Like, why would you go home? You're supposed to come over here and excavate. Why wouldn't she? Why would she go home? Who told her to go home? So she didn't go get none of that stuff I asked her to go get? Okay, now the skeleton is down here. Did she go get, she didn't even go get the, put in inventory. I want you to get that because I don't know if we could use that. What's over here? Okay, nothing. All right. Oh my gosh. What's over here? Okay. All right. So let's see. Dion. Okay. Dion is going to go introduce himself to the skeleton. <gasps> oh my gosh. How crazy is that? Look how he just looked at him as we walked past. <laughs> Can we take a picture with the skeleton? I kind of want to take a picture with him. Somebody All right. He's like, hey, what's going on? <laughs> Zygo Hueso. All right. Let me do a get to know. I mean, we're really going to be friends with the skeleton. Let's do discuss interest. I don't know. I really want to take a picture with him, though. So let's do that because nobody's going to believe. Oh, shoot. I can't take a picture with him. Nobody's going to believe that we saw a skeleton. Boast about his family. Boast about the fact that he's getting married. Discuss some color theory. Your colors are really pretty. Let's uh, tell a funny story. Um, okay. What else can we do? Can we do anything that's beneficial to us? Like, you know, something that'll give us like an edge of the competition? Doesn't look like it. All right. So let's gossip. Do you want gossip, Zygo? Do you have something that you want to gossip about? Let's discuss some more interest. All right. Discuss interest. All right. I really want to get some pictures, though. He's like really having a whole conversation with this skeleton. 
<laughs> He's like, Skeleton, like, oh, I get it. I get it. Do you? Do you really get it? Do you really get it? Take a photo with. Oh, he's not coming up. All right. Eh, maybe we can't take pictures with him. Maybe people don't want to know. Maybe they don't want people to know that they exist, which is totally believable. All right. So where is she at? Okay. So she's coming up here doing this one right now. All right. Um, all right. So now he's going to follow me around. Was that a good idea talking to him, y'all? Because what if he stalks him now? Look, he's even walking like him. That is creepy. Is that not creepy? Look how he's looking at him. Dion. There's a skeleton behind you. Do you see that? Do you see there's a skeleton behind you? Where are they going? Okay, he went the other way. Okay, good. He's not following him. Technically, he's not following him. Good. All right, so it's 10.02. We still have some time. Not a whole bunch, but we do still have some time. So I probably should have him because we've pretty much exhausted everything over here, I think. Uh, he does need to use the bathroom. So I'm going to have him go use this, uh, fertilize that real quick. And then we can... Okay, so she got a fossil rock. Alrighty, uh, I'm just gonna do a once over really quickly to make sure we don't see anything else in here that we could use. Uh, did we pick up those bones? We still didn't pick that up? Or is she gonna get it now? She's gonna get it now, okay. Um, and we won't worry about that, the temple stuff, but we at least got a good amount of stuff on the outside. Okay, cool, so he's gonna use this. Hopefully she'll get down there pretty soon. She's like taking her precious time. I don't know if he's going to fuss about her picking that up, but I feel like we should get it just in case. I mean, even if it's like not worth that much money, because I don't know what to think now. So we got 62. That's 143. Y'all, we are not doing good. 67. The only thing I can hope. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. What's going on? What's going on? Oh, whoa. Uh-oh. Uh -oh. Yeah. What happened? What happened? What happened? No, 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 no. We're not doing homework right now. Just put that on the ground. Uh -huh. What? <laughs> he was mad at me, though. I'm going to do a cheerful. What? Wow. Y'all, he turned his head into 360. That's not cool. Get me out of here, Dion. Dion. Dion, let's go. Dion, let's go. Let's go, bae. Let's go. It's time for us to go. It's time for us to go. I don't know why you try to go view a tree of emotions. It's not even necessary. Let's get out of here, please. Let's go to travel through with Audrina. Take your girl, take your fiance before she gets turned into a skeleton. Cause dude over here tripping. He on some exorcist type stuff. Like for real. Bring me with you. Wait, he didn't bring her with him. Oh wait, she's coming. Okay, I hope she's coming. Let's hope she's coming. All right, really quickly, y'all. We don't have much time. We need to go through. Okay, so we got some over here. Come dig, come dig. All right um we can't go through this right now uh what is it it just says it's cleared okay can't be open right now all right um what can he do okay she's coming through right now okay so what can he do he is quietly looking around what does that mean what's that mean what does that mean okay he's uncomfortable okay no problem no problem we could do that um eat you a grilled cheese eat a grilled cheese no problem not an issue at all. All right, let's see if there's anything else we could do. Can he authentic? Okay, so he has this bone. Uh, we don't have anything else that we could do right now. Darn it. Um, all right, well, can we? Y'all, I don't know what to do. I'm nervous. I'm nervous for my kitties. Uh, so what's this one? Okay, royal baths. I don't think there's anything over there. What's this one? Uh, what's on the other side of this one? Is this where the temple is? Is that where the temple is? Oh, that's that period. Okay. Is there anything over here? <gasps> we could come over here and get this. Let's go dig that. He's going to come over here and get that. I was away from the mic. I'm sorry. And y'all, I think at this point, we're just scavenging. We're just getting all the leftover stuff. I feel so bad. Like, I guess I didn't do this. <laughs> I guess we didn't do a good, we didn't do a good job with this. We really didn't. Um, all right. So he's going to at least come over here and get that. We're going to try our hardest. It's 1221. So we only got like another hour, I think. Um, so where is she going? Okay, she's gonna go pee. Okay, you gotta go pee. So I'm not gonna even stop you with that one. Just go take care of it. Where did she go? Did she go back in here? Oh my gosh, why though? The skeleton's over here. Oh, girlfriend, girlfriend. Okay, so did he dig it up? Okay, he's getting it now. All right, cool. So let's see real quick. I'm gonna pause it because we got like an hour, y'all. I think we have like an hour. Um, we got quite a bit. Well, we got three of these. So let's extract, extract and extract hopefully we got some good stuff um we got a fossilized sea monster 
a fossil, a hilariously teeny T-Rex arms and a fossilized three-toed footprint. Okay. Um, and then we got some vases and then we got this. We need to authenticate or we need to um, do our thing on. Okay. And then he got, uh, let's see real quick. He got um, some stuff we need to do here too. And then I think he has this, which is worth 143. So not too bad. Not too bad. I could have swore he just got an art of, okay. I could have swore he got this. Okay. And I'm saying, okay, maybe he just got that. Okay. So, um, okay. So this is like the little dead end area. So let's try to make our way, um, back through here. Let's go make our way travel through. And then let's see where else we could go really quickly. I need you to run though, Dion, like run, like no run for real, like, or teleport better yet, better yet teleport. Is she done? All right, cool. She's done. Why does she have a book in her hand? Audrina, what are you trying to do? Like you worried about the wrong, I need to sell those books. Travel through, please. Not you, not you go travel through. So we could try to see where else we need to go. Just leave the book. Audrina, oh my God, y'all, she is going upstairs. Are you kidding me right now? Okay, you know what? Whatever, it's gonna be Dion that's gonna have to, uh-oh, what happened? He's about to get stung by bees. Y'all, <laughs> this level of stress right now? Okay, that's the royal baths. We just went through that tunnel. Okay, so let's double check there's not anything over here. This is that, okay, that's that area. Okay, I think I'm remembering where stuff is now. And I'm a little bit disappointed that we didn't do better. Uh, did we go over here? What's over here? What's over here? Is this the plane? Oh, that's that thing. Wait, is that going to go there? Okay, that's that one. Okay. And we can't do this because it says we can't do it now. Okay. Oh, boy. Okay, so this is the baths. All right. Okay, that's the baths. All right, y'all. So I guess I don't have a choice but to go through. Let me double check that there's nothing. I'm sorry. I'm just like spinning this dog on camera all around because I'm trying to go as quick as I can. Um, well, I guess it's pause. I don't have to go too, too. Not you. <laughs> Can I X that out? You're not getting stung by bees. I don't know what they're talking about. <laughs> I don't know what they're talking about, Dion. What are they talking about? You're not getting stung by bees. Hurry up, run, run, run. We only got like 30 minutes. I think 30 or 40. I think it was like 140, y'all. I hope I'm right. But it was like a little bit after one um, when we finally made it. I can't rewind because I'm recording. So unfortunately, it is what it is. Um, so I need him to rush. Rush, please. Thank you. All right. So now we're here. Oh. Now she's about to get stung by bees. Oh my gosh. All right. Oh, let me just ignore her for a second. See if there's anything over here we could grab real quick. So he just came out of uh, this portal. Uh, is there anything over here? I don't think so. Wait, this is the same place we were just at. Am I confusing myself? I am confusing myself. Tra travel to, okay, this is the same place we were just at. Y'all, oh my gosh, I think I just messed them up. And my nose is like done. Do you hear it? It is done. It is done. It is done. It is done. It is a done nose. I think I think I messed us up, y'all. I think I did. Um, so what's this area over here? Okay, travel through over there. Travel through over there because I don't know what's over here. Wait, is that Audrina? Oh, that's Audrina. Don't travel through over there. <laughs> y'all, yeah, it is 131. It's time for them. I feel so bad. I don't even know if they got any good stuff. So let me just go on and toggle them to go home. All right, guys, we are back at home and she's not happy at all. I don't even know if they did a good job or not. And for some reason, Josh decided to come outside and meet them. But oh, so she didn't finish it. Oh, Jessica didn't finish um, the authentication of this. So I'm gonna have her come over here. Oh, wait, did she? Authenticate. Okay, she didn't. Okay, so I guess she gave up because she was super tired. Um, this one right here, though. Oh my gosh, <laughs> I can't with you. All right, so I know she's hungry. I'm gonna have her actually really quickly just eat one of these little grilled cheese thingies because she didn't eat one while we were out. And let me see. He is. Is he? Does he have anything he needs to authenticate? Does he? Can he? Okay, he could just put it in, in his inventory. All right, so just put that in your inventory. There's nothing he needs to do because the strange thing is most of his stuff came already like you know done it wasn't like a dirt clump or anything like that so she's gonna have to come and do the work on hers so he's gonna come put that in his inventory can you grab that please because that is ours um this one right here though yeah I just don't. oh okay let me just go on and see because part of me wants to just see okay okay one baby okay one girl okay so at least she's just pregnant with one girl all right and zane is the dad oh my gosh that dog on woohoo in the dog on uh what you call it um all right so she's gonna come over here 
and uncover the artifact. And I think that's pretty much all she got. I mean, they got they got some stuff. I just didn't feel like that they got a ton of stuff. Um, yeah, they didn't get like a ton of stuff. But they did get some stuff, so and I got to make sure because she didn't have any elements or anything in her pocket. Neither nobody really did, to be honest with you. I know she got like paintings and she got this stuff from when she was in college. This needs to get sold. I'm so tired of her with that book. I'm glad that she's studious like that, but it's annoying because it's just like, at what point? What point do you just sit there and say, "Oh, that's the graduation pictures." Okay, all right. So she's leveling up in the three. She's level three right now in the in the archaeology skill set. I don't know if she gets to level four, will she be able to authenticate it too? I don't know. Which means she could probably work on authenticating all of them. So, either way, I definitely want you guys to chime in. Oh goodness, girl. <laughs> I definitely want you guys to chime in the comment box and let me know what you think I should do. Oh, did she share the big news with him yet? Uh, let me share the big news and let me see how he reacts. She's like, remember when we were in the closet? It's like immediately. Oh, look at his face. Is he excited? Oh, y'all, I don't know. That was like a weird reaction. He kind of frowned. That was a weird <laughs> reaction. You saw that? He had like a frown on his face. So, okay, he's happy from the big news. So I guess that's okay. Um, okay, I didn't want you to be. This was just supposed to be when you went out, Aspen. You didn't have to be. Oh, she's, he's, oh, no, wait. Oh, I didn't give her another one. Well, darn it. I guess. Oh, goodness gracious. I mean, they just go in for it. <laughs> I mean, they just go in for it for real. I mean, he is like crazy about her. So she, oh, she wants to kiss him. We'll go back and kiss him then. Um, let's do, and that propose keeps coming up. I kind of want them to do it on their own, but you know, if they don't, it is what it is. Um, so Jessica, are you done with this or no? Oh, wow. Wow. Y'all, she got two of these. That is insane. She got this one. It was worth 933. This was worth 933 too. She has two of them. I'm almost wondering if she could just go on and authenticate this one. I think I'm gonna let her do it. I mean, you know, is her mood okay? Yeah, she's fine. Girl, go authenticate that too. I need her to get her thing up so she could do it too because that's probably gonna be the only save in grace. Oh, she can. Oh, she can authenticate her own now. So what level do they have to be at? Let me see real quick. Because Aspen couldn't do hers. Archaeology. Okay, they must have to be at a three or four in order to do it themselves. So what can they do to, let's see. Same sims are driven by blah, blah, blah. Archaeology is built by digging up, authenticating, and start studying ancient artifacts. So you know what we might have to do, and this will extend the series a little bit, but I'm, I'm actually okay with it because I'm having fun with it. I might have to have them go to the, um, they are so sneaking cute. Oh my gosh. I might have to have them go to the um, museum so they could go like study the, uh, you know, the museum stuff. And then maybe they can get their archaeology level up a little bit. And then that way they could... Um, maybe perhaps do their own because i feel like that might be the game changer when we authenticate it i was going to go at face value but now i'm feeling like it's not fair because i mean clearly they're going from like 61 dollar items to like 900 and something that's a lot yeah they are just so cute y'all it's ridiculous how cute they are but anyway i kind of want to see if he's gonna like uh let me profess undying love they have an amorous exchange right now let's whisper seductively let's offer a massage let's hold his hands and let's do a little bit of embrace so we're just gonna see what's gonna happen okay <laughs> Oh my gosh they're so crazy anyway so are we we're authenticating this right now so yeah i've decided next episode we'll probably like head out to the um to the um what am i trying to say the museum and let them get all their stuff okay so audrina has determined that the ad oh okay it's poor quality but it's worth 242 so it's not horrible um let's go to put this in our inventory wait put this girl let's get your stuff that's your stuff um but which, which means we probably should authenticate the rest of them so Looks like that's what we'll be doing next episode. We'll be spending time in the house. I need to watch her though, because um, golly, that'll suck if she ends up having a baby during this. Uh, I might have to like push her pregnancy back. We'll play it by ear because if they end up going to the next round, you know, she's going to probably end up giving birth during that round. So depending upon <laughs> why all the guys over here, read, man, you guys are party animals. I mean, you just, I just don't know what to say about you guys. All right. So Jessica has determined um, that the artifact, oh no. Oh wait, it's a terracotta. Okay. I thought it was saying it was a dud. 
Okay, further analysis will allow just okay, so she needs to do further analysis on it. All right, but I mean, like I said, it went from like being worth 60 something to being like worth 100 and something. So, I mean, I totally think it's worth it um, for us to get them to authenticate it. Uh, these two over here, though. Oh, she, oh, girl, we're on vacation. Girl, I like it though. Aspen, Aspen was like, let me just go get my wrench and go fix this real quick. It ain't nothing but a thing. Okay, it ain't nothing but a thing. So the only one that ha we haven't authenticated with her, actually we've done everything for her. So the only thing we haven't for him would be this one. And the, yeah, so I think next episode we'll probably just have like an authentic, authentic. <laughs> oh my gosh, I can't talk. An authenticated off, I don't know what you want to call it, but <laughs> we're going to have them just all like authenticating and getting their skills and stuff up so we could just make sure everybody is um, on an even playing field because yeah, that's just totally not fair. And um, she is actually going to be in her, let's see real quick because I might, have to push her back she's uh, uh oh where'd she go where girl where what trimester are you in it just disappeared on me oh so oh i didn't even know you could do that you right click it and it'll like disappear wait is this that mod? wait oh okay yeah i put the ui cheats mod in i didn't realize that that's what it does all right so let me go into mc command mod let's just see pregnancy she is and her first trimester still okay so i could push it back if we need to just so she won't have a baby but that's gonna be crazy she's gonna be like in the competition very much pregnant i didn't know that's what the mc uh the ui extension i knew i had put it in here because i wanted to play around with it but i just completely forgot about it um anyway he's over here dancing dude do you want to marry your girl or no you want to get married to her but you don't want to propose to her technically he wants to be friendly with dion I guess everybody's being friendly and being nice and everything. So that's really nice. So anyway, I'm going to wrap up this episode. Hopefully you guys enjoyed. Let me know what you think down in the comment box. Oh my gosh, with these books. With these books. You are not in college anymore. I appreciate you trying to do that though. I do. Sell that. Yes, please. Who else got a college book in their inventory? Let's get rid of it. I'm done with it. Y'all are done with school. Y'all been with done, done with school for like a week now. Yeah, it's Saturday. Y'all been done with school for a whole week now. Thank you. Hopefully you guys enjoyed. Let me know what you think down in the comment box down below. <laughs> and I will see you guys next time. Bye.